The MACC has uncovered a serious breach of security in Padang Besar Perlis at the Malaysia-Thai border, believed to be due to corruption involving some border security personnel. The anti-graft agency had obtained security tapes showing such activity as well as smuggling from 2017 up to May this year. The footage shows some individuals carrying white-coloured sacks making a dash to the border walls, while their accomplices from the neighbouring country waited to receive the packages. It is believed that the contents of the sacks are kratum leaves that can fetch a price of 100 ringgit per kilo if sold in Thailand compared to 18 ringgit locally. Other goods being smuggled are said to include cooking oil, sugar and petrol. So because of this breakthrough, we now know how simple and how easy it is uh, to, to let these things happen at the borders because of corruption. So as far as SPRM is concerned, our role is to make sure that this big uh, corruption cannot repeat anymore. So the reason why we are exposing this is so that they know that uh, they are now being watched and we, we already know. I, I think that the, the manner in which you can see they were transporting, it's, they are quite oblivious that they are being audited. Um, uh, they probably have been quite comfortable uh, for some time, but we're not going to allow this uh, to happen. And we are working together with PDR uh, on, on this. The MACC chief did not discount the possibility of more serious trans-border crimes like human and drug trafficking. This is just a, a, an example. Uh, we're monitoring all borders, actually. And not just PDRM offices, but uh, we're also dealing with immigration as well as customs. When contacted by Malaysia Kini, the Inspector General of Police said the Police's Integrity and Standard Compliance Department and Internal Security and Public Order Department launched an investigation after receiving the video clips last month. Tan Sri Abdul Hamid Bado said several personnel seen in the videos have been identified and would be facing disciplinary action.